All right, what's that? Well, this is basically F23 stock manifold versus O34 Motorsports high flow manifold and the G Pop setup. Blue line being the uh, high flow with the G Pop, so a little less torque down low, and about the same, about the same power up until about five, six thousand. That's about where the uh, high flow manifold shows its difference. Right, the high flow manifold is able to hold horsepower more flat. Yeah, we're dropping off on the stock. And let's just compare to the stock manifold on both turbos with water meth would be run number three. So definitely making a lot more power from 4500 on. And I would I mean, the wastegate was really cranked on the old turbo, so that's that's the only reason we're seeing a little extra power right. through that mid-range. So from three to 4,500, but from 4,500 on, F23s really making some good power. So here we're looking at 13 horsepower difference, 13 pound-feet of torque up top. By 5,800 RPMs, we're looking at. You know, same thing about 13 horsepower and then it, it it gets a little closer but the f23 is still holding more power 10 horsepower at 6600 rpms what do you think the egt's how would they be comparing egt is significantly lower we're looking at you know, three 300 degrees difference uh max 1450 degrees on the f23 the old g pop is hitting you know, 1700 and change 